Hey there Aries, welcome back. If you like my channel, please like and subscribe. Also, please leave me a comment and let me know how this reading resonates with you. Alright Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let us know what's going on for Aries this week. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Alright, your first card is the Queen of Pentacles upright. Second card is the Page of Wands upright. The third card is the Devil in your immediate future. The fourth card is the Five of Swords which is this man who is carrying a lot of burdens and um, torn celestial plane, a warning, overconfidence, victory, potency. All right, that's your truth revealed. And for your final card, we've got the King of Pentacles reversed, which means that you need to get organized immediately. Okay, so... The King of Pentacles is the resolver, the sacrificing one, proud, does not like to be embarrassed. So if you're if you're thinking of this card in reversed, then they're not going to be sacrificing or proud, and they're not going to help resolve anything. Um, they're not going to be loving or protecting or mentor you. They're going to do everything in the opposite, all right? But let's take a look and see what else we've got, okay? Hmm, that's a handful. All right, so we're going to use the um, witch's cards for this second section of the reading. Um, this one I really like. Um, I've been working on this deck through... The um, YouTube videos based on witchcraft, and so this 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 particular deck I made up um, with some a couple videos I found on YouTube. One of them is all of them are by the Hearth Witch one 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 eleven eleven, and um. Her channel is called Hearthstone. Alright, so the first thing it says is what's crossing you. And this is the Queen of Pentacles, but it also says that you might need protection. So um, I've listed some different, you know, ingredients that offer protection. So Angelica, Basil, Bay, Cinnamon, Garlic, mint, peppermint, pepper, and marjoram are all things that you can use um, to set yourself some protection, okay? The Queen of Pentacles is an earth sign, Taurus. This is what's crossing you right now. Generous, entrepreneur, talented, mood, or people nurture, helping others succeed so that you can also receive success. Alright, so you might need some type of protection. Alright, I know that I definitely put some cinnamon in my peppermint spice coffee. Page of Wands is your past. And it shows, basically it's got a man looking out over some mountains and he knows he's got a long, a long um, journey ahead of him. You're going to need encouragement, networking, planning. You might be running into someone who makes you feel arduous, which is very labored, a flake, someone who's flaky, and um, the center of attention. So what can you do to get peace? Right here it says Marjoram mint, 
clary sage and lemon balm all right and then for your the devil card the immediate future it shows the devil card and the devil's just you know full of horrible bad juju you know you've got experimentation entrepreneurship recognizing dependency bondage addiction sexuality materialism sabotage work or love jealousy realize when you cannot reach your needs break free detachment okay I went a little too far on the detachment that is reversed okay so rosemary is something that you can use for banishing cleansing fidelity happiness honesty memory protection purification all right and with your truth revealed it shows that we've got defeat card torn celestial plane warning of overconfidence victory potency ample preparation losing uh, unwilling or unnecessary contributions from your losing party luck you have allspice which is something that's in pumpkin spice comfrey nutmeg and heather all right so those are all herbs that are associated with luck if you have any of them hanging around might as well go ahead and put some of those into your cup because it looks like with this defeat card you're gonna need it on the final outcome we've got the king of pentacles reversed which just shows that you really need to get organized okay your plans are falling apart get organized all right Aries and green witchcraft is the card that goes with getting organized so so green witchcraft is like you know um, the herbs and spices that we've been talking about throughout these are they're actually chemicals that will help you um, to overcome these things so you can um, put them in your food and give them to your friends that you love and it can help them to protect them to become peaceful and all these different things that you might be feeling all right and then with your um devil card here I'm gonna go ahead and pull just one narcissist card to go underneath that devil card so we can see what we're dealing with so rosemary is right there underneath the devil card it says you can use rosemary to banish to clear your home to find the truth or honesty for memory protection purification and happiness and if you're dealing with the devil let's go from the top all right the harem all right so clearly I didn't do a very good job but the harem is a group of people that give the narcissist their supply so the devil has his little minions that come after you that's the harem okay let's pull a grim card we really need um, a grim card to help us figure out what the moral of this story is all right Aries Sun Moon Rise and Venus mother Holly if you work hard good things happen all right that's a good one all right so there you go um got you a pretty good reading there let me pull out one or two oracle cards just to help you wait a minute that don't go over here
meditate. Last little bit of advice I have for you, Aries, is to meditate. If you're allowing people to get you upset, riled up, or irritated, then please take a moment to meditate and really clear those negative vibes, um, especially if you are the person who has to get up in front of a crowd or, you know, be the center of attention for whatever purpose. Um, make sure that you meditate so that you can clear the negative energies, okay? Alright, Aries, I hope this resonates with you. If so, please like, and if you haven't already, subscribe, and let me know if this reading resonated with you.